when Samoa Joe will get his lockdown world title rematch against Magnus, the two men who will be chained together at ringside, Eric oh. Young and the Monster oh. Abyss, Taz, they have been beating the hell out of each other in the back, and now they bring the fight into the arena here in Orlando. Yes, out of nowhere, it's just craziness here between these two, and Eric Young, oh. once this guy snaps, good luck. Talk about mean streaks, he's got one for sure. I think Abyss expected this here. And you will recall that last week, Eric Young, he lobbied with MVP to be chained together with Abyss here tonight so that he could prevent any damage, like the Abyss interference and lockdown that cost Samo Samoa Joe the world heavyweight title. Well, we heard last week, Eric Young basically take blame. He told Samoa Joe, more or less, I'm paraphrasing, Abyss is my problem, this is my fault. Like, he created this monster. I disagree with Eric. I don't think that's the truth. Oh, wow. oh. Yeah, but we never expected this kind of a brawl to open impact wrestling. Whoa, 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 Eric Young. Oh, 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 man. Ewan, man, that was great. How about the speed behind that? We've got to <laughs> take another look. Check this out. Take a look at Eric, man. Ewan, look at him. Yeah, flying through the air like Superman. Crazy SOB, man. That was, that was pretty impressive. How else do you fight somebody like the Monster Abyss than to be just as crazy as he is? Whoa! Well, I don't think Eric Young has any problem with being a maniac. Oh! <laughs> Eric, the swing and the miss with the steel chair, but then the steel steps used yeah. as a weapon by Abyss, the shoulder of Eric. Yeah, that's a, that could really tear up your shoulder, tear a bicep, believe it or not, that way with your... With your Go shoulder first and pulls apart your bicep tendon. Mess up a rotator cuff or whatever. But look at this. Look at that violent, just straight raining down with punches by a bit. And again, we said it last week. This is like a, I guess a new and improved makeover of this. He's got a whole different look, different mass, different mindset, motivated by money by the world champion right. Magnus. Who will defend the world title later tonight against Samoa Joe and Eric Young in trouble right now. Eric's down and... Yeah, well, when yeah, you start this, getting weapons this, involved, this is, Mike, where it gets, you know, this is where it gets scary. You're getting in a business playground. That's you know it. what I mean? That, that's the thing. With steel chains and weapons and tacks or steel whatever chains, he wants. whatever, yeah. What does a fist have in mind? Amazed Eric was able to get back up to his feet. Able to block the big right hand of Abyss. Gonna counter and answer several shots of his own. Here comes EY again. Oh, 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 wow. Face first when Eric ran into that steel chair. Shows you how big and strong. Let's take a look at this. Watch the impact, the height, and the bam. Face first Abyss just drove EY into that steel chair. just continues the all-out assault on Eric Young. But you, you think back to the relationship, the history between these two. And how that relationship and history, it is, well, it is history. It's it well, it started, let's be honest, it started with Joseph Park. I mean, that, who is Abyss, and who he thought it was the brother of Abyss, and, and Eric Young, more or less, kind of brought Joseph Park and Abyss together. Right. In a weird way, I guess, even though it's the same person. Help me, Mike, I'm freaking no, myself I, I, out with this you, whole thing. I think you're making, it's weird, you know? you're making awful good points. And now, 
the, the two that, that were supposed to be chained whoa, 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 together. Biting, biting that mask on the head, probably the head, actually the top of the head. But whatever Eric needed to do to get that steel chain from around his neck. This is just, it's not a match, folks. This is like a street fight that's happening in the ring that's done at the top of the show as we saw backstage. And Eric, boy, that's the way to do it. Well, Eric will bring the intensity. Oh, no. Oh, oh my God. That intensity derailed by the black hole slam from Abyss. That was an impressive black hole slam. Splat went EY, and now it might go from bad to worse. Steel chain in hand of Abyss. Oh, oh no. Oh. But this, this, this is where it gets very dangerous oh, here. God. Oh, to, think, think of the, the power behind that chain when you've got somebody 350 pounds pulling with everything. Is he trying to do snap his spine? I mean, really? He's to choke him out. How much, how much more of this can Eric nah, Young take? Eric looked like he's out. Look at this. his head. Just turning Purple. all different shades. So a brawl between EY and Abyss that started outside, then the fight worked its way into the building, then into the ring where EY. Abyss got the better of Eric Young and choked him out EY. using a chain and the ropes. Wow, what a crazy way to kick off Impact Wrestling and Taz. Eric Young, he's in rough shape. Well, the question I have is will EY be able, I mean, to be out here for the main event where he's supposed to be chained up next to with, you know, Abyss. So we have to see what happens with that.